नमस्कार ग्रेट मैन इंटरनेशनल स्कूल की ऑनलाइन क्लासेस में मैं आपका स्वागत करता हूं कोविड 19 महामारी के इस दौर में मेरा ऐसा मानना है कि आपका परिवार पूरी तरह सुरक्षित है स्वस्थ है और बच्चों ने लॉकडाउन में बहुत एंजॉय किया अब मैं आपका सपोर्ट चाहता हूं इस ऑनलाइन क्लासेस में बच्चों की शिक्षा को हम अब स्टार्ट करते हैं और बहुत ही जल्द जो भी आपका बैकलॉग है हम उसको क्लियर भी करेंगे और एक नए तरीके से आपकी शिक्षा स्टार्ट होने वाली है पेरेंट्स का हमें पूरा सपोर्ट चाहिए आप लोग पिछले दस सालों से लगातार हमें सपोर्ट करते आए हैं और मेरा ऐसा मानना है कि अगर हम और आप मिलकर चाहेंगे तो बच्चों की शिक्षा का कोई नुकसान नहीं होने वाला है और हमें और आपको मिलकर अब एक रीस्टार्ट करना है नाउ लेट्स रीस्टार्ट बेस्ट ऑफ लक नमस्कार हेलो स्कॉलर्स हाउ आर यू ऑल डूइंग आई होप यू ऑल आर गुड एंड सेफ एट होम I'm sure you had lots and lots of fun during all these holidays. And so now it's time to get back to studies. Now you all have moved to grade 1, right? Yes. So here I will be teaching you English. And let me tell you there are two books for English. First one new images where you have beautiful poems and stories with amazing pictures in it and the second one is cornerstone through which you will learn the usage of grammar so today in this class we will be learning the first poem from new images so i want you all to get ready with your books open page number 1 before we start reading always remember that put your index finger below the word that we are reading and move it as we are moving further and you should do this all the time when we are reading okay now let's read the chapter name put your fingers yes W H A T what D O E S does L I T T L E little B I R D I E birdie S A Y C and there is a question marks so what is the name of the chapter what does little birdie say so let me ask you one question here how many of you tell your mama and papa i want to grow up i want to do things like you i want to behave like you i'm sure most of you do that right yes so here in this poem there is a little birdie and what's birdie it's another name of a bird okay so even this birdie wants to do something and it is saying to its mother so let's go ahead and see what it is turn to page number 2 do you see a word written there r e a d read yes put, put your book finger just below it let's start w h a t what d o e s does l i t t l e little b i r d i e birdie s a y c now move to second line put your finger below the word in i n n h e r her 
N E S T nest A T at P E E P P O F of D A Y day now let's read these sentences again move to number 1 what does little birdie say in her nest at p of day now nest everybody knows right where the bird lives and then what is p p e e p p in this poem p means sunrise that is when the day starts so when the day is starting the little birdie says something to it mother so now, so now let's move to line number three ready with your finger good l e t let m e me f l y fly s a y s says l i t t l e little b i r d i e birdie next line m o m o t h e r the mother l e t let m e me f l y fly a w a y away let's repeat these two lines again let me fly says little birdie mother let me fly away so what the birdie is asking its mother mama i want to fly away but the birdie can fly it's very small right can it fly let's see what mother says next line line number five B I R D I E birdie R E S T rest A L I T T L E little L O N G E R longer T I L L till T H E the L I T T L E little W I N G S wings A R E R S T R O straw N G E R good stronger let's repeat these two lines birdie rest a little longer till the little wings are stronger so did you understand what mother is saying that you need to rest a little more so that your wings get stronger and why the wings have to become strong yes because the birdie can fly now let's move to next line line number seven s o so s h e she r e s t s rest a l i t t l e little l o n g e r longer t h e n then s h e she f l i e s flies a w a y away so the birdie listens to its mother rest a little longer and then she gets ready to fly away okay now we will move to the next page turn to page three now let's read from the first line here put your finger below the word w h a t what d o e s does 
L I T T L E little B A B Y baby S A Y say next line I N N H E R her B E D bed bet, A T at P E E P P O F of D A Y day let's repeat these two lines what does little baby say in her bed at peep of day so when the day is starting what is the little baby saying here yes the baby is again asking something let's see let's move to next line now line number 3 B A B Y baby S A Y S says L I K E like L I T T L E little B I R D I E birdie next line L E T let M E me R I S E rise A N D and F L Y fly A W A Y away. So let's repeat these lines. Baby says, like little birdie, let me rise and fly away. And what does rise means here? R I S E is to get up. Okay. So the baby wants to get up and fly like whom? Like little birdie. And where is the baby now? The baby is on his or her bed. Right. Now let's move to next line. B A B Y baby. S L E E P sleep a L I T T L E little L O N lawn G E R girl longer T I L L till T H E the L I T T L E little L I M B S limbs A R E R S T R O N G E R stronger. Let's repeat these two lines. Baby sleep a little longer till the little limbs. Are stronger. So what is baby's mother saying here? Baby's mother is saying that you need to rest a little longer to get your limbs stronger. Now what does L I M B S limbs mean? Limbs mean baby's hand and legs. So for the baby to get stronger it has to get its Hands and legs stronger, right? Next line. I F if S H E she S L E E P S sleeps a L I T T L E little L O N G E R longer. Move to next line. B A B Y baby T O O two S H A L L shell F L Y fly A W A Y away. Let's repeat the last two lines. If she sleeps a little longer. Baby too shall fly away. So when the baby's limbs get stronger, the baby can also fly away, run away, isn't it? 
Yes, isn't it a beautiful poem? Just like how you kids want to run away. Yes? Now, so for today, we will stop here. And I have some homework for you. You will do the reading practice of this poem. And then take out your English copy. Okay? There is a link below in the description box. Click on it. You have a file there in which dictation words and question and answers are given. You will read them, learn them and then you will write them in your English copy. Make sure you do your homework. Okay? Every day the reading to be done. And then when you learn the things, you will be writing it in your copy. Okay? Till then, stay at home, stay safe, wash your hands frequently. Okay?